Hey guys, today we're here with this beautiful ACR Bushmaster. Let's go. Hey Freunde, ich habe ein Video in Deutsch gemacht. Schaut mal rein. So, as always, the gun is unloaded and clear. And today I'm here with Sven from uh, LH Tactical and from Schnupperschießen Bayern. If you're from Germany, this guy is the one you need to go on a shooting range. But today we're gonna talk about the ACR Bushmaster. It's produced here in the US and mostly by ACR and a couple of other companies that we found out. Yeah, Magpul and Remington. Magpul and Remington, and as you can see, I'll give it over to you, um, there's a lot of Magpul parts, like the whole lever, the stock, and all kinds of pieces are made from Magpul. Shoulder has six different um, positions. Then you have... You can fold the stock. Yeah, oh yeah, you can fold the stock, which is really cool. Then you have these QD mounts on the back. Here. Here. And two in the front. So Oops. let's Roll let's mode. go uh, over a few data for you. Huge shout out to Vienna Arsenal and to Brava Series 6 and Tech Merch, where you can get tactical merchandise for women and men. The ACR Bushmaster is available in different calibers. We shot it in 556 times 45 and there's also a 7.62 times 39 and two more exotic calibers with a 6.8 times 43 and a 6.5 times 39. The overall length is 35 uh, 37.28 inches. Its weight is about 7.99 pounds. And um, for the magazines, you can put like almost every standard AR magazine in there. So there's, I think there's uh, special ones for this, but I'm not really sure. We shot regular ones. So the barrel length is about 11.5 inches. And the price, um, according to ACR, I guess, is $2,200. It depends, you know, if you have a dealer with a good price for you, you can get it for maybe a bit less. So this rifle is a gas operated. What's really cool, and we're gonna show it here, you can uh, change the gas pressure. If you wanna shoot uh, suppressed with a suppressor on, you also can see there's the possibility to put a suppressor on. There's a few things we found out. Um, the charging handle, it looks like it's non-reciprocating because it's moving with the uh, bolt. But we found out while shooting, uh, it's non-reciprocating. So you can put your thumb in here and be safe while shooting. This of course was semi-automatic. And if you have a full auto, which is not possible here, um, this thing shoots about 750 rounds per minute. What's also cool, um, Picatinny rail on top and on the sides from back to the front. So there's a lot of room where you can set up all your fancy sides and stuff. So one of the things that I found very uh, crazy is down here, you have the bolt release and here you have like your mac release. So when I was shooting 
and I was out of the target and I put my finger up here, I accidentally hit the switch and dropped my magazine. So as soon as you know it, you can trade with that, but I didn't know it from the beginning, like I couldn't just go from zero to all the way, yeah, you know. So I accidentally dropped my mag, which you can see later, but overall, beautiful to shoot. And we shot it from a, a tripod, tripod, ball counting. Really cool thing. Um, made a lot of fun. Okay, guys, let's go out on the shooting range and show you what the thing is capable of. See you later. Fucking it up. Okay, Nothing. Okay. Okay. Doesn't re reciprocate. I told you it doesn't reciprocate. I tested it. it we, yeah, we tried it and it, it, like it was it working. Well, you did it wrong. I <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>